Josh here with Josh Nam Golf, and today we're going to talk about weight shift or pressure shift in the golf swing and what should happen in the golf swing when it comes to moving your pressure from your lead foot to your trail foot and then back to the lead foot, what great players do, and then what I see a lot of high handicappers do. So I've got a balance board here, and you can see it's almost like a little teeter-totter that goes up and down. And what we're going to notice in a lot of good players is they tend to set up 55 to 60 percent of their pressure is on their front foot, 45 percent or so on their trail foot. So you can see how this part is off the ground here. Now, very, very early in the takeaway, good players have a pretty dramatic pressure shift into their trail leg. So you'll see me kind of stomping down here as I start the takeaway. Now, notice I said pressure shift and not weight shift. And the difference is you don't see good players move their whole body over. They stay fairly centered, but they're really pushing down on that back leg early. As we get near transition here, you're gonna see a very aggressive pressure shift now down into the front leg. It happens right about left arm parallel a little higher into the backswing. That pressure starts shifting as they finish their backswing. Now they get into their lead foot. It's kind of like a pitcher throwing a baseball that the leg's going forward or the pressure's going forward as the arm's still going back. Now what I see in a lot of high handicappers is they set up on their back foot. They stay back here the whole time they don't move their pressure forward early enough. And when the pressure doesn't get forward early enough, the arms start the downswing, they come over the top and they hit that dreaded slice. So we're working on getting the pressure to go back early, forward early and through. That's gonna help pick up club head speed, pick up consistency and just help your overall game. So another drill, if you don't have a balance board, and I'm sure you've all seen this one before, but I'm going to step with my lead foot into my trail foot almost immediately in the takeaway. Then I'm gonna step back right before I get to the top of my back swing and swing through. This is gonna help give me the feeling of what a proper pressure shift or weight shift should feel like. So it'll look something like this. So you can see on that, all of my pressure went into my trail leg starting the back swing. About here, I step forward and press onto my lead leg. That gets me through on the correct plane, the body's working correctly, and I hit better shots. So if you struggle with your weight shift in the golf swing, try this drill and I know it'll help you out.